Hello YouTube, and today I went to Target and I picked up a couple things. I picked up uh, some, I don't know, these things that make your room smell good. You did some of those. Uh, let's see, I got a, this is actually pretty neat, a PlayStation, gosh, uh, PlayStation 4 Media Remote. Figured that might make a fun video out of. Um, milk duds because they're delicious and then finally I got some Pokemon Pokemon cards one sec let me just yeah there's kind of the best view we're going to get so yeah I got some Pokemon cards uh, let me do a small cut so that way I can go grab some sleeves and we'll be back all right so I did my jump and I grabbed my sleeves um, I don't know why I have those sleeves. <laughs> I found them actually ironically with a couple of our Pokemon cards in my boxes. So, yeah, so the ones that I grabbed are this weird variety pack with uh, three three of the uh, X and Y Evolutions booster packs, which uh, we're going to do what those are in a minute. And then this mystery... <coughs> mystery box uh so basically enough i'm not expecting to plus off of either of these uh, i just i don't know i've just been really nostalgic toward pokemon lately and i figured this be a fun little video to wrap up a sunday with so i'm going to open this off screen real quick all right so the mystery pack promised one foil card. Let's see what foil I got. I got a... Oh, that's neat. That's Slow King. Uh, is this a fake card? <laughs> this does not feel... I don't know. It doesn't feel legit, but it's also been years since I felt one of these things. Uh, yeah, I got the Slow King guy. Uh, I love Slow King. Slow King is actually... Slow King and Slow, po slow Bro are uh, two of my favorite Pokemon. Sorry, just grabbing some sleeves here. Let's sleeve them up, even though the card is already bent, I guess. <clears throat> there we go. Then, uh, so we got three packs. We got X and Y Evolutions, Roaring Skies, and Steam Siege. So, <laughs> You know, pretty much guaranteed not to plus off of these, but uh, I figured they'd be eh, fun to make a fun little video of. I think I'll save the X and Y evolutions for when we open our other X and Y evolutions. So, let's try Roaring Skies. Alright, so... If I remember correctly, so first off though, uh, code card on the back for you guys, I will not use that. If I remember correctly, you're supposed to go three to the back, one, two, three, then you toss the energy, god dang it. <laughs> okay. Alright, so let's see, we got Dragonair, great Pokemon, Executor, fun little guy. We own a uh, Wyon Wyn Wynona Dratini. Is this the is Roaring Skies Inke? Is Roaring Squ Skies the one where the set where they introduce dragons not to? Because uh, I'm getting a lot of dragon Pokemon. A full art not to, but not a GX or EX or anything like that. But uh, set that aside. That's pretty cool. Togepi. Uh, for the reverse hollow, we got Switch, and then Klefki, who actually, I really like Klefki, I don't know, there's something about him, he's really dumb, and silly, and goofy, but I like him. Then I got a Steam Siege, which, is this a set that, uh, Rainbow Charizard is in? No, it can't be, it's not Steam Siege, right? Uh, I thought it was a Sun and Moon set. All 
All right, so code guard, code card for the you guys. Then we go three to the front, and okay, this one ended up upside down somehow. Okay, and a riff, cool Pokemon. Nidorino. Uh, Steelix Spirit Link. That's how you Mega Evolve Pokemon in the TCG. Quink. Mankey. Classic. Fungus. Ooh, check out this art. Okay, so this is really cool. This is a... I, I think they're called Plasticine. A uh, Plasticine type Pokemon card. Uh, yeah, I just... I don't know. I really like that art. Nidoran Male. Oshawott. Okay, so we got Bergmite for our reverse foil. That's pretty cool. And then I got, ooh, foil Bisharp. That's pretty dang nice. So let's sleeve that bad boy up. Uh, I didn't mention it before, so you want to try put your rare or foil cards, you want to try and put those in the sleeve upside down. That way, when you put them in a binder or something like that, you just uh, you put them in. Uh, what do I explain this? You put them in, you know, going through, and then no dust gets through or anything like that. All right, so let's open the X and Y evolutions box. Oh, junk! I dropped two cards. So we have four packs of X and Y evolutions. Uh, this gave me a foil Brakeson, meh, and then a oh, this is pretty neat actually. A Froki coin, yeah, Froki. I like Froki. Uh, I, I mean, I like his evolved forms more, but yeah. So let's sleeve up our Brakeson. I didn't sleeve the uh, reverse foils because those typically aren't worth anything. Uh, I think the only ones that are worth anything are the uh, are the trainer ones. Those are typically the ones that are worth anything. But uh, yeah. So if for those of you who don't know, uh, X and Y evolutions are reprints of base set, and uh, they're basically just reprints of base set, but with I don't know, modern stats, like there's a couple of card differentials, so, yeah. Okay, so we got the code card for you guys, if anyone wants that. Then we go three to the front, and there's not one on the back, because this is base set. Poliwhirl, oh god, I love that. Love that art. Trader Maintenance, Potion. Ooh, check out that Growlithe. Just sitting there. Ratatata. Okay. Electabuzz. Now this is one of the best. Uh, one of the best cards in base set because uh, he's just a great sweeper and everything. Electabuzz is great. Magikarp. Drowsy. Oh, check this out. We got the Nido King Break. Okay, that's pretty sweet looking. And then uh, Doug Trio. But yeah, we got the Nido King Break. Let's sleeve that bad boy up. Yeah, he looks awesome. Oh my god, I always really like Nido King too as a Pokemon. Uh, yeah, it's just a great. Is he a special sweeper in competitive right now? Yeah, he's a special sweeper. Yeah, he's a great Pokemon. Well, competitively he's alright, but yeah. So then we got another pack. Um, but yeah, so back when I was a kid, uh, you know, I was like every other kid obsessed with Pokemon. And I remember when I went, Bo, Bobo's go. My dog just walked up and went like, hey, what you doing here, boy? And then like knocked my card pile over. Thanks, Bo. And now he's just, he's just messing all kinds of stuff up. Uh, there we go, code card for you guys. And then, uh, we go three to the front. Uh, but yeah, so back when I was a kid, I remember when I opened up base set Charizard, uh, and 
I darn near crapped my pants. <laughs> Even back when we were kids, we, I don't know, we just knew how special that card was. We got Revive, Nidoran Manhole, Seal! Uh, I love Seal. Seal is such a great Pokemon. Like, not great in the traditional sense, but I just love him. Alright, we got Sandshrew. We got a Reverse Foil Onyx. And then we got Farfetch'd. Farfetch'd sucks so much, you guys. Oh, God. Farfetch'd is so bad. Like, competitively speaking, he might be... I don't know if I'd say he's the worst Pokemon, but God dang, he's bad. Alright. So, code card for you guys in the back. And we go three to the front. And for those of you guys who are wondering, you go three to the front because if you pull a, if you pull a rare, it's uh, guaranteed to be in the front. Machoke, full heal. Ooh, Kakuna. Kakuna Matata. I don't know. Caterpie, love ca love me some Caterpie. Gastlia, love this art for Gastlia. I don't know why. I've always just really liked that Gastly art. Diglett. Charmander, standing at the... Uh, all stoic like Voltorb. Then we got Pidgeot Spirit Link. And then Arcanine. So I haven't pulled a foil yet from uh from base set uh from X and Y, so or from Evolution yet, so Ah, come on. This is the last pack, so we gotta do it. Once in a lifetime, you guys. Once in a lifetime. We got this. I believe in us. All right, so code card for you guys on the back. We go three to the front. De evolution spray, Metapod, Professor Oak's hint, Weedle, Doduo. I always like this art. I don't know. I always just find I always find it funny that Doduo can like run at top speeds and pick up uh, flying or something. Fairy Energy. Ooh, the Reverse Foil Gyarados. Okay, I'll take that. That's fine. And then the Farfetch'd, whatever. I'll take this one. This is a good one. I mean, it's probably worth nothing, but eh, whatever. I don't care. Alright, so that was me opening up just some random Pokemon cards. Uh, I don't know. This was pretty fun to make, though. Uh, I will sleeve all of my Reverse Foils just because we didn't get very m many, if any, Hollow Foils. But yeah. So if you guys like this video, like it down below, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and follow me on Twitter at Bandscoop. Have a wonderful day, YouTube, and peace.